Hey guys, what is going on? Last time you guys may have heard from me, especially if you guys are from Romania, freaking like 95% of you, you may have seen a video where I actually tried my best to learn a little bit of Romanian with my friend Valerie. If you haven't checked it out, I'm gonna be linking it down below in the description box. It's absolutely incredible. But nonetheless, still I've been receiving a lot of recommendations for more musicians to cover, of course, from your beautiful Balkan country. Romanian Music Part 5 officially passed 100,000 views, which as you guys may or may not know, that's usually when I like to drop a new episode. So pressure, but no pressure, but make sure you share this with your friend and your grandma and your mom and everyone else in between because uh, I'm trying my best. So of course, as always, you guys have hand selected several of these musicians and I'm very excited to check them out because I saw some familiar names, just saying. So let's go right ahead and let's find out about these amazing musicians. Don't forget, you could always check me out on Instagram. It's an amazing way for us to talk back and forth. But besides that, how about we get started with our very first one? Now the first one, just a heads up, the guys are unknown, and you guys already know who I'm talking about, of course. So half of the group is from Romania, half of the group is from Moldova, as far as we know, and of course we have an amazing musician that had a phenomenal, phenomenal song with them. Up first, we're gonna be checking out Carla's Dream featuring Delia with the song, Cum de Noi. All right, let's check it out. Which, by the way, I noticed that it's like cat music, and I already know like that. Oh. I miss Carla's room. God, this young lady's voice just like pops. I love the marimba in the background. The I love it. Production value always amazing, like Jesus Christ. Let's go to the floor, she's chocolate. She's a promise that no one may be in your dad. Finime, she's a bit in it. The vrea no read. Cres que no ar fia sha. No substele. Since for the stars come Romeo, come to wear in yell. So the team of the man, so the cupin the ding the shell. Come to a cupin show, come up the bank and the squad. Jesus, perfection as always. I got so freaking excited when I found out there was actually a collaboration between Carla's Dream and Delia. Like, like, let me just say like, okay. So when I checked out the Moldovan series, of course I had to put Carla's Dream in there as well. Cause once again, we don't know they're mysterious guys, but they're absolutely incredible. And not to mention, I love the freaking like just presentation. Like these guys are always like just shaking up the industry. Like. If you guys are watching this and you know who you are because clearly none of us do, you're killing it. And of course, Delia just has such a phenomenal voice. Like it's just so piercing, so unique. There's something about Delia that she has done a phenomenal job just marketing herself, doing a phenomenal job singing. She's a very talented like vocalist. What can I say? These two was the perfect match in heaven. I gotta give this a solid 10 out of 10. An amazing way to kick off the series again, just like I remembered it. It's almost nostalgic. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but I've been doing this series right here for over a year at this point. Pretty crazy. But up next, we got a musician collaborating with yet another one. I love it when people collaborate. You always get like the best of both worlds in one. But we're gonna be checking out Connect R or Connect R. I would assume since it's a Latin. Barboot, maybe. I don't know. Featuring Shift with the song Bagamare. Let's check it out.
Și nu-i ușor să-i calci în perimetru E atât de hard că sparge termometru Cea mai tare lady, slim ca shady Bagă mare, connector și baby Nu știe să gătesc, nu știe să iubesc Dar să iubește pe ea Frumoasă cum e ea N-are multe clase, dar are multă școală în ea Știe întotdeauna să obțină ce vrea Da, da, da Frumoasă cum e ea Și de ce să muncească pentru lei? I love the guitar, it's just like so simple Și banii lui sunt de parale Că frumusețea are costul ei Da, 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 da Wow! You see, it just comes to show. Even though the hook is so simple, it's just so powerful. Like it just hooks you in. Răspund, aștepți 11, 12, 13 secunde Super, superficial, wow, cum e femeia Când o vezi rămâi bălan ca Andreea Ai nevoie de ajutor, mayday Paradox nu-ți dă nimic, deși are tot ce vrei Pe cardul tău și tot ce ai prin portofel Știi că dacă pleacă nimic nu mai e la fel Bagă mare, bagă mare Că banii lui se joanie Și banii lui sunt de paralel Jesus Christ. So right off the bat, by the way, if, if you guys don't remember, I only played two minutes of the song, so forgive me if I'm cutting you off early. Several of you guys have mentioned it. Please forgive me, it's the way I run this series. But these guys are doing such a phenomenal job. It's such an upbeat, like groovy thing. Like it's so simple, so straightforward. Guitar player just dim, 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 dim. And then of course you got the drummer just really just kind of keeping the beat and these guys are carrying it all the way through. Now mind you, I probably am pretty, pretty sure that the guy with the five o'clock shadow is uh, Connectar. The guy had a very, very safe flow to him, just very, I don't know, it just sounds like Party Central. Like I want to go where this guy is going to perform. Like it just sounds lit, I'm just saying. Shift, you're pretty cool, man. You're all right with me, bro. Kitty, you did a pretty awesome job as well. You guys are both killing it. It's another amazing song. This one was more like upbeat rap, like very nice and groovy to it. Like I personally enjoyed it. This right here is a solid 9 out of 10. A great, killer, amazing, phenomenal job. Holy crap, I feel like I'm cursing, but I'm not. Which, by the way, my friends, if you are not aware, you can actually help support this series here by clicking on this link right up there. It takes you to my Patreon page, some amazing perks, and we could get to know each other on a one-to-one -one level. How cool would that be? But of course, if you can't support, it's perfectly fine. Just please make sure that you hit that like button down below. And if you can, hit that subscribe button and the bell icon. It really helps, of course, notify you when I upload, and it helps me feel good about myself. All right, my friends, up next, we're going to be checking out another collaboration between two musicians. The first one's name is Lino Golden, and the second one is called Aspie. I would have rethought that name before I named myself. Anyways, with the song Panamera, let's go right ahead and dive right in. You know it's a real music video? Because they put a portion in it. The build up in the background. Yeah. All right. Even though this music video was filmed in a garage, I'm glad that the editor had like a, a vision. Bye. 
want no medal. I'm assuming this is ass pee. There's this one guy in the background with like a short hairdo and like a like a California necklace and he's vibing hard man he's like I respect that bro <laughs> There we go. I like to stop it on time, otherwise I get anxious. It happens. But, if there's one thing that I've noticed, this type of music seems to see like, like it seems to be repeating itself and it's so interesting, like as you guys may know, I'm like, like a world connoisseur when it comes to music. And it's so interesting seeing the same type of music like repeat itself again and again and again and like similar styles as well, like in the whole like, I don't know appearance but nonetheless it's not a bad song i'm not trying to criticize the guys like just because of their appearance mind you nothing wrong with that but the song it does go heavy it's pretty pretty great the production pretty amazing lyrics i don't understand but i'm assuming there's a gun involved at some point what makes me think that yeah. <laughs> The song definitely vibes, it's much more newer, I would probably want to say like rap, trap, and everything else in between. They trapped me because they got my, they got my, my ears, my, my heart, my soul, right where they wanted. So not gonna lie, usually I'm more against this type of music, but you know what, this one actually, it, it vibed with me, alright guys, this right here is a solid 8 out of 10. What do you guys think? Which, by the way, my friend, so once this video does hit 100k views, I definitely want to make a part 7, so no pressure, but I also would encourage you to drop some more musicians down below in the comment section. Up next, we got a musician coming back for, yet yeah, like, the third, fourth episode at this point, like, and I'm not complaining, like, this guy is absolutely bomb every single time, always delivers. Up next, we're going to be checking out the first solo musician on this list that goes by the name of Smiley with the song De Unde Vi La Hora Asta. And all my Romanian friends just slightly died a little inside. Anyway. I've noticed that this, like Smiley loves pianos. And so do I. Which is great. Eu trecut de două noapte când străpunge liniștea, o bătaie repetată, insistând la ușa mea. Credeam că rămăsese descuiat, mai devreme așa era, dar probabil mai devreme... I'm kind of sad, Smiley isn't smiling, he's sad. Și mă îndrept spre ușa, să mă uit pe vizor, tu îți ca... Still sounds great. Rătăcită, crezând că eu dor, dar stai liniștit. Am vrut să te aștept Nu mai ești binevenită Am deschis doar să te întreb De unde vii la ora asta? De unde ai umblat? Vi cu haina și fonată Și cu părul derajat Ai uitat unde ți-e casa? Și de mine ai uitat Ia-ți amintirile și du-te Că la mine e cu ea Man, this guy does not know how to make a single bad song, bro. Try to pay him. He can't. It's impossible. Și când răspunsul este evident L-aș ochii în pământ Iar tăcerea ta îmi spune Mai mult decât un cuvânt Și mă îndrept spre ușă Să mă uit pe vizor Tu îți cauți cheia rătăcită Crezând că eu dor Dar stai liniștită Am vrut să te aștept Nu mai ești binevenită Am deschis doar să te aștept God, man. 
It always sucks having to stop it. Like, smiling never fails to ever deliver just a written fact in case you did not know. Like, it's actually a little bit weird because I'm so used to Smiley being, of course, a little bit smiley. But this time he's been a little bit more sad. Like, and I, and I hope, I hope whatever you went through is, is long gone because you deserve happiness, my friend. Like, you are a very, very talented musician. This right here still, nonetheless, still blew me away. Like, more of a darker tone, but it's so interesting seeing this man play like two double faces here. Like, this is sick. Not only has he made such an impression with me personally, I know for a fact this guy has been touching lives all around the world. If you guys follow the platform TikTok, if I'm not mistaken, he has a song on there that has been like remixed or like sped up or anything, and it took off. I believe it was Akasa or, wait, what song was that? Where's my phone? All right, I found it. It's actually the song that featured Alex Velea and Don Baxter, and of course, Smiley. Wait, and the song was called Kai Versi Pe Peretti, which I actually checked out, I believe it's in part two, three, one of those. Check it out if you haven't. It's always nice to rewatch the series. Just saying. But anyways, it's very intriguing to see Smiley taking off and making such a major difference, not only within his community and around the world. Of course, so many kids have been jamming out to this song alone that it's the least to say. I love the fact that even though this song had a bit of a mellow tone, he still decided like to BAM! Open those windows, I don't know if you recall that in the music video, but he opened the windows and suddenly he was feeling a little bit better about himself. Or at least that's what the music indicated to me. It's not like I was a musician or anything growing up, you know. <laughs> yep, good day. But anyways, what can I say? I'm absolutely thrilled that we ended the song, the series, the episode with Smiley over here. This, of course, is a solid 12 out of 10. Forget the freaking scale. Give him a solid 12. That boy deserves it. Good job. Well, my amigos, what did you guys think about the video? Let me know down in the comment section and don't forget to hit that like button. It really does help out with the YouTube algorithm. So if you're not already sharing it on your Facebook page, hit that like button. Don't forget, we also do have a P.O. Box right over here, so you can send over handwritten letters, postcards, or anything else in between. If you have not been aware, I do collect postcards, so please let me know if you send some on my Instagram page, because I would love to personally thank you. And until next time, my friends, hasta la pasta, and I'll be seeing you guys on the flip side. Bye.